Hi guys, we're really lucky right now. We got, uh, <laughs> amazingly, Miles McLagan, former coach of Andy Murray and current... Celebrity coach. Celebrity coach, current coach of Marcos Bagdatis. Miles, uh, thanks for having us. Thanks for joining us. Yeah, you're welcome. Thanks. Um, Miles, first of all, I have to bring this up. Last night, you were wearing an awful T-shirt <laughs> and uh, <laughs> you told me about 10 minutes ago that you were going to wear something special for us tonight. And uh, you've come down in this. Take me through the outfit and the, the choice of t-shirt. It's pretty simple. It's, it's a pair of jeans and a t-shirt. I mean, I'm more worried about you wearing the same shirt as you wore that last night. That is the same shirt two nights in a row. You're worrying, also uh... worrying about the sweat patches under your arms. <laughs> <laughs> you know, did you have any questions? You... <laughs> <laughs> Almost as worried as I am of that thing you got going with the hair there. But uh, anyway, Miles, um, who, uh, who's the messiest guy in the changing room for you? Um, who, who's a, who leaves a, a tip? That's a very leading question, isn't it? Yes. You know it, huh? I know the answer, and that person's been said before, but please say. Yeah, I mean, you, you wanted me to say Andy is terrible. His stuff's everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Miles, uh, quite a few of the coaches, you know, there's different styles of coaching, obviously. A few of the coaches like to get on court in, in practice sessions and hit the ball themselves. Um, is there any coaches in particular that stand out for you in terms of striking the ball very cleanly? or? Um... Yeah, there's, there's a few. Who, who, who likes to get out on the court? I'm, I'm always amazed that players don't like to get on there, but it's not all, not all that can sort of hit at the same level or maybe above their own players sometimes. Okay, and uh, <laughs> <laughs> anyone that you think can, can, can outplay their own player? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I, I just when I was on the court with you guys, I, I, that's how I feel. I don't know if it looks okay. like that from the outside, but yeah. that's just how I feel. I'm not sure if that's the case. And are there any are there any players uh, in a forehand cross court rally that you wouldn't back yourself against? Uh, no. Okay. Sh should I send a warning out now to anyone, <laughs> like left of the court? when you have a backhand not to duck <laughs> because Miles is known to hit backhands very late um, and also Miles you know talking about yourself uh, you know you, you pride yourself on, on your nickname Muscles McLaggen um, <laughs> I saw in the gym today you did five chin-ups very easily is there anyone who is in uh, or who is in the best shape as a coach uh, say yourself if you think it is you no, I don't think so. I mean, because also the one, the, the chin-ups I did with one hand, I'm not counting those either. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's a few. Javi Piles Perez coach is a great runner. Um, but he hasn't got the, the muscle bulk. Well, it's a different kind of fitness, isn't it? Okay. Um, <laughs> <laughs> this could look so bad. If you guys are going to edit to this, I could look like such an idiot. <laughs> I promise you. So it's an accurate reflection then, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, so you're saying you are the, the strongest? But maybe not the best runner. Uh, who's, no, there's some, some good ones out there. Javier Pilez is out there. Who else is uh, trying to think? Um, which other? I've got to go through the rankings. It's, it's not Marion Vida. <laughs> 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 it's. Um, who else is? Mon Mariana, Mariana Monacasi, a very good runner. And there's a few. Uh, but uh, yeah, I like, coaches, to, like to stay in shape to make yeah. sure that when I get on court with guys like you, I'm sort of leading the way. <laughs> okay, and uh, lastly, Miles, who, uh, being amongst players and, you know, for the last few years, who has the, the quirkiest habits, superstitions, and um, generally who, who sort of, you know, has different, different routines and things? I, I think all players have um, a lot of funny routines. I think it's actually the nature of sport because you're so, you're so taught to use routine and to that, it, that it, it's a fine line going from routine to superstition and guys will say well you know I think it's Federer says oh I'll never use the same shower well that's you know two days, it's, well that's actually become a superstition mm. or guys and um, I, I think I think they all have funny things and you know the, the ones we see most often like Rafa because he's on the TV I mean mm. it, it, it gets built on and built on all the time yeah. and he's got to step here and then step there and then he's got to add something else so I, I think they're all got some some, some funny habits. That's a good point, really. Yeah, well said. That's a man of experience right there. A strong man as well. <laughs> Very strong. A strong, bad, fashionable fashionably bad man but uh, anyway thank you very much Miles well, for, uh, for joining us, joining us. Boys, thanks, thanks.